Gist with Marie Glow. Welcome, my beautiful people, and it's a very, very yummy day. And I hope uh, at the comfort of your home, why not? Uh, just stay tuned with us with that beautiful, solid data of yours just for 30 minutes. And trust me, you'll be learning something very amazing today. But before we get to that, remember, you are watching and listening to Grace of Production Studios and online TV. Maybe you are just uh, getting the production house for the very, very first time. But trust me, Grace of Production offers you a lot, a lot of services like movie production, graphic design. If you want to be a professional, more they trust me this is the platform for you if you want to be an actor a talk about in the country of Cameroon yes this is a platform for you and a lot more that has to do with the camera and today we'll be having Minister Vicky Boy she'll be telling us why God created me why God created you and why God created everything that makes up this beautiful world yes and you're watching us all over the national territory from dubai from canada from cameroon from boya we are saying a very big shout out to you and from me to you it's a mwah. so stay tuned with us because when we come back you'll be having your minister of the house meanwhile i want to say a very big shout out to the incredibles yes to you mr lensman to 237 gospel community to you minister fangia to you minister vicky voice and to you 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 all all the incredible family thank you so much It's Holy Gist with Marie Glow. And it's that amazing time, beautiful people. And I hope uh, you guys have really, really been anticipating this day. And yes, it has come true. And on my left hand side, we have this beautiful, amazing, beautiful gospel. She's making the gospel out there in the world and all over the national territory of Cameroon. And it's a pleasure and an honor for me to have her uh, all the way from Duala, Minister Vicky Voice. And I'm super excited. Good my I welcome to the program. <laughs> Thank you very much for this opportunity. And you look outstanding. You too, thank you. <laughs> Greetings everybody. I'm called Vicky Voice and it's really a pleasure and an honor to be right here with you guys, with everybody. I'm really grateful. <laughs> Alright Vicky Voice, we're really so much grateful to have you here. You know it's not easy. How's your journey? Stressful, too much traffic, but we thank God for the You are alive. Yeah. And you are right safely. <laughs> exactly. Aww, it's a pleasure. So thank you, Jesus. And uh, right here, remember, we said Holy Jesus is being taken to the street and with our director, the finest behind the camera, Minister Lens Mana. Yes, we call him a minister because what do you think about um, this um, slogan, minister? Minister. Does it go just for people who sing gospel songs? No, no, no. I don't think minister goes for people who sing only songs. Okay. Minister, it's, it's a title on, on just like a president. All right. A president is not just a ruler of the county. Somebody who has to make everything intact, guide people, you know. It has to do with a lot of things. Wow. Same thing with minister. It is not just because you, you, you sing which makes you a minister. You could be a, a doctor. You treat people, you make them fine. You have to understand each and every single part of the thing you're doing to be called a minister because you're managing. Oh, wow. A minister is like a manager. That's a lecture yeah. for another day, but I guess you really learned something new and that was out of the box. But remember, yeah. we don't always want to make Holy Jesus so boring for you and that is why we came up with that. And I'm sure you heard a lot from Minister Vicky Voice. So if you want to know more, why not follow her on Facebook and inbox her to ask her more. So Minister mm -hmm. Vicky Voice, we are out here and somebody might be wondering, where are we? So can you tell us where we are? We are somewhere very beautiful, um, <laughs> nature oh, here yeah. in Goya, and just to say Cameroon has a very, very beautiful land. It has beautiful places and if somebody doesn't know, they can, if they tell you this is Cameroon, you actually refuse. Yeah. You can see how beautiful this place is. Mm -hmm. yeah, so. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, before all, you know, the reason why um, we had Holy Jesus episode 23, this hot, sunny, beautiful, handsome day is because we want to know why we were created mm -hmm. and you being a minister of the day we know that you have a lot to tell us so in five minutes can you tell us why we were created okay thank you for this beautiful opportunity well you with your permission i want to take us back to our roots okay okay um we all know that our parents adam and eve were created for there are three reasons please i want to take us back there are three the base the base of the purpose why we were created we have three things. God created human being because he needed company in his likeness. Okay. He wanted people who were going to look like him, who were going to keep him company. Secondly, God created human being because he needed people who were going to look after all the things, to command, look after all the things he also created, apart from human beings. Okay. The living things, he needed people who were going to look after all of them. Then thirdly, 
God created us because he cannot praise himself. <laughs> so he needed people who were going to praise him, All to right. praise and adore him. Okay. But well, this entire stuff changed after the scene in heaven. Okay. After our parents, our grandparents, our foreparents, Adam and Eve committed the sin. Okay. Everything changed because after the sin committed, they were now able to differentiate between good and evil. And we now we can get it from the Bible that they chose the evil sector more. You saw, you saw the way bad, bad spreaded, evil things spreaded, yeah. up to the point that we couldn't have direct conversation with, with God, God again. Abraham communicated with God, Moses communicated with God, but because of the evil things that spread into the world, we did not have direct communication with God again. That is why, as merciful as he is, he brought his son to oh. die for us and be a bridge between going to him. So now, as we are created now, the next purpose it is for us to bring people to Christ, okay. to remove people from the evil part of this world to the good part of the world, right. which is Him, our Creator. You know, I'm kind of confused with that statement because mm -hmm. I'm sure maybe our viewers out there too will be kind of confused. Mm -hmm. When you say uh, um, God is raising people to remove us from evil to bad, but remember good. also that, okay, from evil to mm -hmm. good, thank mm -hmm. you so much. But uh, remember also that um, this world is a very beautiful place, very, as, you very friend, beautiful. as you said in the beginning. So yeah. where is the evil coming from and who are the evil people we are removing from evil to bad? You know, someone other them okay. might be really confused. Rectification. Yeah. When we talk about removing people from the evil world to knowing Jesus Christ, it is because we know more about sin. Okay. We know more about sin. We, we are so much exposed to sin. Okay. So we removing people. Okay, there are so many people who say, who is God? Yeah. God does not exist, but actually he's our creator. Now being our reason for creation is making people understand. Those who have refused completely about knowing Jesus, knowing God, letting them know the truth, the way and the life, bringing them back to the person who created them. So um, how can we do that? By preaching the word of God. Ah, by preaching so, the word of God, by living the example. So you mean I'll just pick up my Bible, I'll just go out to the street and I'm telling everybody that Jesus loves you, come. Is that what you mean? Oh no, you need to, you need to accept him as your personal Aha, Lord and Savior okay. first. <laughs> All right, thank you so much. That was a very good one. And beautiful viewers, do not go anywhere because I see a lot for you. And we'll take on a very short break. And uh, during this short break, we'll be having what Mini Saviki Voice has for us. Titled, is All I See. So stay tuned with us and we'll be right back. Smile. Do you know why? Why? Ah, uh, because even now, just you don't even <laughs> smile. It just me. Oh, and I feel like also smiling. Well, we thank God. <laughs> All right. Before we went on a very short break, uh, I'm, I'm sure you enjoyed. It's you I called. That was done by Minister Vicky Voice featuring Minister Fang G. A very beautiful piece, and I recommend you to go on YouTube and Facebook. And why not just type Minister Fang G, and you will be serving it. Or why not go to Grace of Production? page and have a tips of that but before that minister vicky voice you know we're talking about why god created us and mm -hmm. i really learned a lot from you and i want to say thank you so much once more thank you too so for now we want to know who is minister vicky voice so can you tell us where you hail from 
Okay, uh, Minister Vicky Voice is from the littoral region okay. and from the southwest region. That is Amedwala stroke Bayangi. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. So, on what inspired you to like go for the name Vicky Voice? Well, <laughs> well, well, well. Vicky, Vicky is my name actually. Okay. But the voice there, I was being given it by my manager, Banji. Okay. Yeah. Ah. He, he attributed the name to me somehow, someday when we were at the studio. You know carried by the spirit i don't know what happened he just he was like as from today your name is vicky voice uh -huh. and i obeyed because okay. you know everything that has to do with divinity we don't joke with you it. don't joke yeah, yeah so wow, and it has been a, a wonderful wonderful name you know really. so what's your best meal or tell us what you guys eat in the little rush my Bayangi. goodness yeah. don't joke about that ah, arrow uh, with arrow. enough of oil oh. <laughs> You made me just feel hungry. <laughs> and a very big shout out to all the Bayangas and the ah. Stroke Little World and Bayangas people watching us right now. And we say we love you so much. So, uh, Ms. Vicky Voice, can you tell us about um, your recent works and uh, maybe your past work? <coughs> well, about my recent works, we have some pending jobs okay. at the recording label JA Records. Okay, shout out a to the collaboration, A collaboration with Minister Fangi and okay. Minister Marceline. And recently I have just been doing um, backup for some gospel ministers. We have okay. Apostle Lady Caroline. Okay. I've been doing some backups, you know, it's still at the, at the back of everything. Then we also have Minister Cornell Grace. We are, right. we are working uh, for one of his songs upcoming. So everything is going to be unveiled as Aww. time unfolds. <laughs> That's a very good one. And shout out to you guys working with Minister Vicky Voice. And I'm sure you guys are really doing a lot to push her out there. And that is where we are privileged to have her right here in Douala. And thumbs up to the manager. Because if not the manager, trust me, you won't be here. I won't. All. Am I mad? <laughs> <laughs> You're not mad. You're blessed. <laughs> all right, Minister Vicky Voice. Um, can you tell us uh, um, if you're single, <laughs> searching, married, or you want to tell me, like, Minister Air Brandon, you are waiting on the Lord. So, <laughs> tell us. Oh, so, Minister Air Brandon said we are waiting on the Lord. Yeah, he said he was waiting on the Lord. Oh, my goodness. Mm -hmm. um, well, I'm not waiting on the Lord because the Lord has already answered my prayers. Oh. Uh. <laughs> so, you're not, are you searching or um, you're no. already married? No, I'm not searching. Okay. I'm not married. Okay. Still to, by God's okay. grace. Wow. By That's God's a very grace. tricky answer, but I'll just leave you because <laughs> you know it. If we want to go really deep, something will happen. Yeah, something will happen. <laughs> so beautiful view, yeah, that's just a little uh, uh, bit to, 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 you know, to free you of the mm. tension up. So we're going to go on a very short break. And when we come back, trust me, you'll be having a last, last second of the day with us. Is that not so? C'est ça. Oh, you have something <laughs> to tell us. It's Holy Gist with Marie Glow. Welcome back, beautiful viewers and listeners of Grace of Production Studios and online TV. Very big shout out to you, Devon Free, the dude of the house, all the way from Bameda. Yes, sir. We are proud of who we are. Shout out to you, Alama, the lady with uh, regulating our sound. A very big shout out to you. And uh, welcome, my beautiful people. If you are just me, you're listening, you're watching uh, Holy Gist, episode 23 with Minister Vicky Voice, all the way from Duala. Good day, ma, and welcome once more. Thank you very much. Thank you. It has much. been a tough afternoon with you, and I'm really getting inspired. Thanking you so much. Thank you for listening. All right, let's dive down to the Cameroon uh, music industry. That the two three seven gospel industry. What can you say about that? Well, 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 well. I could write an essay about it, about the two three seven gospel music. But um, I'll say I'm very, very much pleased with the kind of unity which is coming in, and okay. I thank God for everything. Yeah. All God right. So, what do you think the government can do to upgrade the Cameroon gospel music industry? By you know, opening platforms. Okay. Platforms for the two, three, seven gospel ministers to showcase. Because the more you showcase, the more you win souls. Because you are not singing to entertain. Right. You are singing to win souls. So, if there are many other platforms which are opened, then it is going to be very easy, you know, to win souls to. All right. So, um, what can you say about uh, those who have attained some level of, you know, fame in the Cameroon gospel music industry? What do you think they can do to support the others growing up? You know, there is this saying that um, money is not everything. Oh, okay. Money is actually not everything. We want to feel, we want to feel the sense of belonging. 
right. they have already been at the top they have gone through a lot and others are upcoming so the least we need and we are pleading from them is a sense of belonging you know making others who are coming up to feel belonged making them feel loved making right. them understand that they are going somewhere okay yes at least feel motivated mm -hmm. so do you feel that there's no unity in the cameroon 237 gospel music industry uh -huh. quite a long story <laughs> that's a very very tricky answer but i'll just let you go scot-free for today but next time you're going to expand straight on that statement thank you beautiful viewers and hope you're really having a very great time and minister fangji behind the camera is just giving us some smiling faces meaning it's really going and we are having it right here so good with nature mm -hmm. so oh, minister vicky boy before you go can you tell us uh, any advice you have for us or upcoming gospel artists yes i have an advice I'll start by pleading that um, if we call ourselves gospel ministers, then we should have a little bit of humility. All right. We need to be humble because there is humility in Jesus Christ. Uh -huh. If Jesus Christ was not humble, he would not be able to tolerate all the trash he received when he was still trying to you know, bring people to him. So let us try to really be humble and so much down to earth. That is, we are, let us preach the gospel through ourselves, through our characters. So I'll okay. just end there. So uh, what can you say about the slogan? People say um, people who are humble, they don't get respected. So they love people who like carry their shoulders up. So do you mean that I should sleep on the floor so that somebody will come and mash me? Or what are you trying to say? Just Cameroonians, tell us. Cameroonians take everything for, they get things really, really, really twisted. Okay. Yeah. So when we talk about being humble, it is um, celebrate grace. All right. Celebrate grace. You know, we have arrived no limit yet. We are still struggling. Wow. So know your lane. Know your wow. try to be as how will I put it? Celebrate grace. <laughs> Celebrate grace. That <laughs> is All right, problem. my people. Minister Vicky Boss is yourself. telling us that honor grace mm? yeah. you guys to celebrate and grace yourself. when you don't grace. carry shoulders well, uh, well, don't know okay. yet. Yeah, <laughs> all right minister vicky right before you go um please you know from your voice minister vicky voice you know we've not gotten that raw part of your voice yeah. you know we just listening we just left with you from the studio so now i want to have it live so please <laughs> do a very little nice acapella for us you know i and your fans want to enjoy oh really yeah acapella <laughs> oh my god mm. <laughs> okay getting sweet ah. okay um like you first you said you i call i really want to make a little a cappella on that you All i right. call because we call on the name of the lord in everything we do sure so i'll just do something like it's my name my voice i just ate arrow before coming here ah my <laughs> oh no problem we'll manage it okay so Everything about my life, it's you I call. In my depression, Lord, it's you I call. When they rebuke me, it's you I call. When I cry out loud, it's you I call. In my achievements, it's you I call. In my destiny, it's you I call. In my finances, it's you I call. In my marriage, it's you I call, for your name is holy, holy, Jesus holy, are you, I think that's okay, huh? too much red oil. Ah, uh, you are too short, but notwithstanding, thank you so much, I mean you have a really lovely voice. Your Thank voice you. is not Thank different God. from the studio or the recording. Yes, and I must, I must commend that maybe if you didn't eat that arrow, <laughs> mouth, you'd have done so, so wonderful. But that was really, really good. I enjoyed your voice. Thank, Thank you. you so much. I want to say for my part, I want to say thank you for your humility. Thank you for your timeliness. Thank you for your consciousness. Thank you for always liking Grace of Production. Thank you for always sharing and commenting. Thank you so much, Vicky Voice. But before you go, one last word for Grace of Production Studios and online TV. Thank you for everything. Well, I'll say this and I'll keep saying this. Um, Grace at Work Production. I stand as the, at the forefront to say thank you very much for everything you are doing for us, we gospel ministers, because you know, um, some other platforms will ask for money, 
you know, avant de faire ceci, tu dois donner comme ça. And, you know, they will not treat us with so much love and understanding yeah. that you guys are so welcoming. It, it feels like I've known you guys for ages. No, so, you're, 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 you're at home, girl. <laughs> you're at so home. So thank you guys so, so much thank for the so. love, for the acceptance, for everything. May God really bless you guys. Amen. And by God's grace, if we keep growing, why not becoming a partner? Oh, yeah. that's the best news I've heard this <laughs> afternoon. Uh, Thank you so much, Minister Vicky Boy. It's beautiful to be as you all Thank heard you. from Minister Vicky Boy. It has been a long ride, a long afternoon with you, and I hope we really kept you uh, in the spirit this afternoon. Uh, Minister Vicky Boy, mm -hmm. before you go, seriously, before you go, you know, I cannot, cannot just leave you go without asking you this question. Can you tell us a little bit about your record level, like acknowledge them just for two yeah. seconds? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gold League production, that's been my routine mm -hmm. ever since I started ministration, okay. ever since I started recording, ever since I started singing. Gold Bliss production, I say a shout out to you. Thank you so much for, for accepting me, for seeing the talent in me and, you know, for consecrating yourself in making me rise. God bless you and all thanks to uh, Boss Kiss Bliss and Fine G. Fine okay. G, he's always been the root of everything, you know. <laughs> he picked... He picked a talent and said, you're going somewhere, you're going wow. with me. So I really All thank right. you guys. Thank you so much, Mr. Vicky Boy. Beautiful be as I'm going because I'm going to come back, we call it the rap. And we are saying a bye-bye to Mr. Vicky Boy. She'll be traveling back to Douala. Mm -hmm. So stay tuned and why not? We'll be right back. Thank you. It's Holy Gist with Marie Glow. Welcome back, beautiful people of Grace of Production Studios and Online TV. If you are just tuning, you are watching live on Facebook, the program Holy Gist, episode 23, brought to you by Grace of Production Studios and Online TV. And at this point, uh, we've been learning a lot from Minister Vicky Boys all the way from Douala. And we're saying a very big shout out to all the Douala ministers. Uh, and at this point, I uh, will be telling you that uh, if you are interested in modeling, in movie, if you want to become an actress, if you want to learn how to design good flyers or anything that has to do with the camera trust me grace of production is right here for you it's how to train talents and bring in the best out of you just to name a few and uh, we have a surprise for you this december we have the premiere of why not god's heart featuring minister first from Menko and a lot a lot of amazing amazing other ministers you wouldn't want to miss that film huh and again uh, there is a surprise for you we'll be having one future film and two short films uh, where another film will be a surprise for you and i'm uh, telling you that where money ends that's a very tricky one, right? What happens when money ends? I just want you to stay put, stay anticipated. And if you haven't liked Grace of Productions page, why not just tap in that like button so that you get a lot of details and gist because uh, Grace of Production is just not just all about those three movies. Uh, there is another cast of crews of Legends Alive. And if you haven't watched Fearless, that's you being anger. If you have a problem with anger, why not go on YouTube and just type Grace of Production Studios and watch. You'll be seeing a movie talking about anger. You know, anger is a really bad thing, and it has really made a lot of a lot of people to do drastic things that uh, they will regret after. So why not go to Grace of Production Studios and Online TV YouTube channel and uh, just have a little time, a little memorable time with that beautiful piece? And why not, as subsequent things keep popping up, uh, you will get updated. Yes, we live in a modern world, and being informed is very, 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 very good. So thank you so much. I've been your humble host, Marie Glow, and a very big shout out to you, uh, Minister Lentman. Yes, to you, because without him, I wouldn't be right here shining, you know, looking glowing on the flyers and everywhere. So thank you so much and stay with us on next episode.